the clouds came lower and it was no more friendly, you know, like I hear the voice of this goddess. Go away from here. I was very angry with Kay too. I just said, why you took my love away? Imagínate decirle a la mujer de, de tu amigo que, que acaba de perder al marido, ¿no? Six months later, this decision to come back here for me was really hard. Durante un tiempo estuve pensando si volver o no, eh, porque bah, era sabía que iba a ser duro. I came here together with a very nice group uh, from uh, yeah friends or also Shani. When I saw K2. From the airplane from Islamabad to Skurdu, I was with mixed feelings, full with love and hate. The trekking camino eh, hacia acá, esos cuatro o cinco días sirvieron mucho para preparar esta procesión. I just felt that I should pay this honor and tribute for Atenas. Queríamos poner pues una placa que he traído para poner en el memorial al final de la expedición en recuerdo de Sergi y eso es algo que, que sé que a la familia le va a hacer ilusión y eso ya me dio pie para para motivarme para venir. Por un lado pienso, ¿para qué vengo? Porque veo la mole que es, como siempre, y me impresiona. Por otro lado, tengo sentimientos raros porque ahí se quedaron buenos amigos. Yo sabía que, que llegando a Concordia se abría este valle y que la vería. Y la verdad es que cuando se empieza a abrir el valle, me daba miedo mirar a la izquierda, me daba miedo porque sabía que iba a estar. Y la verdad es que cuando la vi, es una grandeza. I'm not afraid to see her. I look at her with mixed emotions, but she is still for me the most beautiful mountain on the planet. También seguramente nos juntemos aquí unos cuantos amigos. Sabíamos que cada vez nos acercábamos más a, a este encuentro y eso me fue preparando mucho. It was really nice to share this emotion with them because we can understand each other. We are with the same purpose here. Hay muchos sentimientos encontrados. Laughing and crying at the same time, it shows our mixed feeling because we remember these people with, with their smiley faces, with their positivity. I feel really grateful that I'm here. Oh, 
at the same time, it's really sad for us because we lost our beloved. Oh, it was like you were there again. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, you, you saw what happened? Huh? It could happen with every one of you. There was like, uh, you know, lottery. On 16 stycznia 2021 roku, dokładnie 15:58, właśnie w tym miejscu. Usłyszałem szum. Wydawało mi się, że to może być jakiś kamień lecący z góry. Wyciągnąłem odruchowo kamerę. Wtedy dopiero zauważyłem, że to leci w tył człowiek. When I saw falling down Sergi and I realized this is a man. Oh my god. When I saw him go down, I go running for for see him. Dogonił mnie Juan Pablo z Chile. You saw what happened? I don't know. Le cayó una piedra y bueno, pues eh, lo mató en el acto y y cayó hasta el campo más avanzado. W tym miejscu podstawy ściany znaleźliśmy ciało Sergiego Mingote. I think he not suffering nothing because eh, all the heat was very powerful. Towarzyszyliśmy mu przez tę ostatnią godzinę czy półtorej godziny, kiedy jeszcze oddychał. We took the body to the base camp from ABC. Understood. You are never ready to see dying somebody. Never. Lo llevan al hospital de Escardú, donde tienen que certificar su muerte. Yo tengo que reconocer también el cuerpo y la verdad es que no es no es nada agradable, ¿no? Ver a tu amigo. Allí muerto y bueno, pues con las heridas que tenía. Para mí el, el trago más, más duro, digamos, eh, fue comunicar a la, a la mujer de Sergi por teléfono desde aquí, eh, minutos después de su muerte, lo que había sucedido. ¿no? Eh, Imagínate decirle a la mujer de tu amigo que, que acaba de perder al marido. ¿no? When uh, things are like this, people stand together. He passed away in a style, in a way, in a things that he loved doing. So I'm sure his soul is in, in rest, in, in peace. Właśnie mi a pół roku od tych tragicznych wydarzeń tutaj na Katwa. I heard something happened with Atanas. It was a summit push which he cancelled already and he was going down. And I was very happy because the expedition uh, was at its end. And uh, you know, this happiness uh, that we are going back to our normal life. I went to the puja. And I just, just pray and hope that everything will go well, but... Like, I realized that he will never return back alive. I had this new about Atanas falling down. I was just sitting down, starting to cry. He was found at ABC, which was like, oh my God, this is almost two kilometers. And I just 
hope that he wasn't suffering. I was um, asking to the sky, to this, to the god of K2, what, what's, what's wrong here? What, what are you doing? You know, I came here with so much positivity, so much motivation, so much love. I did a lot of meditation. Everything was calling me here, and everything turned so bad. Jest dziewiąty lipca. Udało mi się dotrzeć wraz z pierwszą grupą szerpów do obozu trzeciego na K2. Można powiedzieć, że nikogo tutaj nie było od czasu, kiedy na początku lutego około 18 osób próbowało tutaj spędzić noc w trzech namiotach przed wyjściem do ataku szczytowego. I think it was at midnight. You always want to close yourself in this small world. You need to prepare, you need to concentrate. And so it was like if I think back, I'm really sad about this moment because I even didn't give him a hug, you know. He just went out of the tent and we were looking at each other and I said, I know you can do it. And yeah, and then he followed the lights going up. It was so cold and I didn't want to think about how they climbed the whole night in this condition. Wyjściu do ataku szczytowego na K2 w próbie zimowego zdobycia tej góry. Życie straciło kolejnych trzech spinaczy. Alisa Dbara, John Snorri, Juan Pablo Mor. We have to be together to talk about the mountain, to plan together. It's like a big, big family. Yeah, we are unity. We are strong here. You know, this is important things in the mountaineering. We were per uh, perfectly ready. This year, uh, there are strong teams. You know, strong climbers. It was very cold. It's, you see, I'm freezing and shaking, and very, very difficult. Yeah. Next winter we are ready to just push it direct to camp two, camp three and, and summit from camp three. That's our plan. lipca dotarła do nas informacja, że w okolicach szyjki butelki udało się odnaleźć ciała. Trzech osób, Juana Pablo, Jonas Noriego i Alego Sadpare, którzy na początku lutego wyszli w tej ostatniej próbie ataku szczytowego. We knew, of course, about the, about the climbers who had died in winter. Um, I personally didn't expect to find um, any uh, traces of them. I, I was expecting an accident because all of them together disappeared or at least didn't come back. News hit us when we were in Camp 4. First, there was a confirmation that found one body, the first uh, summit push team. Y al chileno, al uh, Juan Pablo, estaba más abajo del campo, cuatro más abajo. Seguramente estaba tapado con nieve, no la vimos. Cuando vi primer cuerpo fue al Ali Mohamed Ali. Su, 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 justo estaba su hijo delante de mí cuando él vio a su papá y empezó a llorar. Y... Then we stopped together with Tajit as well. And we were, um, yeah, I'm just uh, there witnessing how he, his son found his father. So it was very emotional. And a bit higher up, we found, well, yeah, we expected indeed to find um, John Snorri as well. It was very strange to see an intact climber, let's say, because my first thought was, who is sitting there? It's just is it is it a climber still uh, just having some rest? But then, of course, it appeared to be uh, John Snorri, who was there since uh, since he was missed in uh, in winter. Para mí fue un poco shock, no, cuando vi los cuerpos. Nos quedamos en la cumbre como una hora. Al bajar, lo encontré al Sajid con su papá y me dice que si podía ayudarlo. Te 
empezamos a bajarlo y uniendo las cuerdas y hasta abajo. Y ha sido duro bajarlo y después arrastrarlo hasta campo 4. Y ha sido para mí un enorme honor haber podido ayudar a la familia pakistaní. Una felicidad grande de poder haberlo ayudado de corazón. Bueno, Sergi, cada vez que subías una montaña decías que el águila vuela de nuevo. Para ese águila vuela sobre nosotros repartiendo felicidad y, y entusiasmo, que es lo que tú ponías en cada proyecto. Has dejado un hueco muy grande, no solo en mujer Miriam y en tu hija Julia, sino en, en todos tus amigos que, que eran muchos y hermano, en mí también has dejado un, un hueco muy grande. Be here for us is super important. This winter was crazy. We lost great persons, great friends, great families. We share a lot of moments with these guys. It was really amazing. So, thank you, thank you for be part of this 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 dream that they have. <coughs> this uh, all this. Thank you, thank you, Tammy too, for all this. Really, for be part of the last part of his life. Uh, uh, I believe that now he's somewhere up there with his friends, Sergi, JP, Snow really, and they're all together, laughing again, joking, dancing, and protecting us. So I'm really happy that we could have this experience all together because I think this helped us a lot and I feel already lighter. So I, I left a lot of emotions and a lot of tears. La montaña no es ninguna asesina ni nada de eso. La montaña está ahí, ha estado siempre y somos nosotros los que nos empeñamos en subirla y, y asumimos los riesgos. K2 is just K2, a beautiful, savage mountain. We should respect it. I don't know if you remember, but I asked you in winter for one word in Italian to describe K2. Do you remember? But I don't know what I, which word I used. Bellezza. Bellezza. Bellezza, oh my God, yeah. This was maybe before all this happened. And now? <sighs> Intensity, maybe. What I saw, what I felt, all these tears and all these the thoughts. I think that at the end, all of this is giving me a lot of strength as well. It was, it's still so painful, but um, 
came in here um, helped me to accept that uh, life is impermanent, you know? K2 for me is or was and is a really good teacher and I'm just thankful for everything I was able to live. Dla swojej pasji oddali życie, zostawili tutaj bliskich, ale zostawili też wspaniałą pamięć o sobie i myślę, że trochę naszą misją będzie też kontynuować to ich dzieło. Maybe this is the price of dreams. This is the price of uh, searching of our boundaries.